you are concerned about losing your luggage on a flight, listen up. Karen mm -hmm. Stiles will help you track it down. No, actually, she's got some tips here <laughs> on how we can be compensated. All right, so we get to the destination and we find out we have no luggage. What are we supposed to do? Well, the first thing you want to do is obviously go to baggage claim. Look yeah. for it there. Mm -hmm. If it's not there, talk to the people that are at the airline counter down in that area. Sometimes that baggage made it there before you did, or it may be en route. If that's not the case, you want to make sure you file a claim right away. Document everything as best as you can and ask them to get that delivered then to your hotel, your home or some other location. Okay. What if we're talking about, oh yeah, uh, you were going to New York, it's in LA and they're saying we'll get it to you in a day or two. Yes, that can be a hassle. If you've got a delay like that, most airlines will compensate you for reasonable expenses just to kind of get you by. But again, you've got to have receipts and it has to be reasonable or they're not going to reimburse you in full. If it's lost, though, what you want to do is to make sure that, again, you're contacting that airline, filing that claim. Uh, in that case, they've got to reimburse you for what you paid for a baggage fee related to the fare, mm -hmm. as well as okay. they're going to reimburse at the depreciated value, not the necessarily yeah. actual right. cash value, of those contents up to $3,500 for commercial flights, uh, up to $1,600 if it's domestic or uh, international. At that point, I'm not even caring about the $25. I paid to get it on the plane, yeah. but being able to get some compensation for luggage lost. Yes. So if that does happen, sometimes airlines will try to go a little cheap on you. You want to renegotiate that with them. If that's not working out, contact your credit card company. Sometimes they have some benefits or can help you to dispute it or file a claim with the U.S. Department of Transportation mm -hmm. uh, and then copy the airline on it. Sometimes that gets you a little bit faster action as well. If nothing else, you can always contact our Call for Action office for help. We're happy to help in any way that we can. And in the meantime, just bring a spare outfit in your carry-on. Yeah. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Right, good information, thanks. If you need help with a consumer problem, our Call for Action volunteers are ready to take your call. Just call that number right there or request help online. Click on the icon you see there on our page, tmj4.com.